morning. Um, yeah, it's been a long time since I've been on YouTube. My name is The Lush Diva and I am formerly a plus size blogger and boutique owner. Um, I had to close my business after pandemic and pregnancy and um yeah i also just moved towards creating content for myself and so now i'm just a content creator i just like blogging my everyday life so that's what i'm doing so right now i am a virtual um teacher i'm a mom I'm working on my finances and my ultimate goals right now are to just create a stable home for me and my daughter. I want financial stability, I want mental stability, and I want health stability because I do have rheumatoid arthritis and it's pretty bad. So I'm just working on those things. So I just thought I would take you guys on the journey with me like as I'm figuring all this out because I've just I've always shared my adult life with the world and I enjoy it. It's therapeutic for me. I love it. Sorry, I'm about to run. So yeah, I just want to show you guys kind of what I do day to day and just how my life is going. So I'm actually getting ready for work right now. I have a nine o'clock meeting and that's actually 8.56 so I'm going to hop in my meeting and just kind of everything that goes into being a work from home mom so my daughter does go to daycare most days even though I work from home um it's just easier but you will you'll see her sometimes but yeah, so I'm just doing my skincare really quick. Love these good molecules. Skincare is so lovely. Just gonna moisturize my face and then I'm going to hop into my meeting. Head to our first meeting. So I have to get ready and take my meds for the day. Well, I actually have to restock my meds. I'm gonna eat a banana for breakfast. And a little bit of water here. So the fun thing about being an online teacher in underserved schools is that none of my students show up pretty much all the time. And so I'm left with a lot of time to do other things. Um, obviously that's not what I signed up for teaching for. So it's a little disappointing. 
you know, to show up to my Zoom class and just not have any students, but what can you do? So, this is so good. I'm just learning how to just take advantage of it in my day and not be depressed about it and not sulk and just, yeah, use that time to keep me help, help, healthy and happy. So I didn't end up having any students. There's a power outage at, um, sorry, the audio. There's a power outage at the school. So my first and second block classes were canceled. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm going to take out my trash and then I'm going to head to Walmart and look for some clothes for my daughter. All right, y'all, there she is, my baby. I'm here at the Walmart World usually get all of Audrey's clothes from this section in Walmart, but they were kind of shopped out today. So I ended up heading on over to TJ Maxx, I'm sorry, Marshalls, to see what they had. up getting any outfits for my daughter. I'm really frustrated about that situation. I really want to talk about it because I had to buy her fall wardrobe and all of the pieces are gone. So I just left it to do something. I was taking my car through a little wash. Um, yeah. That lettuce was bad, so we'll use this one instead. That I have left over with me yesterday I like that kind of salad better now So I've been eating a salad for lunch every day just to try to have a little balance. My diet had gotten really, really bad. So even though I have fried chicken on it, it's a little better. <laughs> okay, so I did not end up having any students today. I'm about to take a little nap before I go pick up my daughter from daycare.